Hi YouTube, it's Eli, and I really have a strange fascination with preserving things, in a sense. I mean, well, not really in a sense, most of it is just fact, but it's a little weird. I wouldn't really describe myself as a person who reminisces a lot, a reminiscent person, a little, you know, maybe a couple years ago, but now... I definitely would. A lot of things that I just, you know, have inside jokes with my friends or things like that. I always try and, like, you know, screenshot the origin or something like that. I don't know. I, I just have lots of different pictures on my phone of just inside things that I look back on constantly. And I find it so cool to have each thing preserved, which I feel like is kind of, you know, the basis for taking pictures. But still, I feel like this is a little different because it's not like I'm capturing a memory. It's not like I'm trying to do it so that I can remember it. I'm just doing it so that I have it. It's almost like a catalog. And I really, really enjoy retro video gaming, and I feel like this might have a tie into that. Because, I mean, yeah, video gaming as a whole is really popular, and so that's no surprise that a 13-year-old boy would be into video games. I'm just saying that with specifically retro gaming, I do really find interesting, and I have a love for it. Not always just playing it, but just uh, watching videos about it and reading articles about it and stuff like that. And I feel like this might have a tie into that. The fact that I like preservation might also tie into the fact that I like to reminisce and have a fascination with things from the past and not necessarily my past i have a really weird nostalgia which is interesting since it's only really like a nostalgia for a few years which isn't a very common form of nostalgia but i really do have that form of nostalgia and if you look it up, it does just say past. It doesn't mean adulthood looking back on childhood. So it still is nostalgia. I just, whenever I talk to people about it, they always say that it isn't. But if it isn't, then I don't know what it is. Because I just have great memories of playing Wii games when I didn't know how to play them. And playing with my cousins who were like infinitely better than me at Smash Bros. And just... <laughs> having fun and uh, learning to get good at Mario Kart and stuff like that. Or playing Pokemon White in the same spot over and over and over again because I didn't know how to save my game. And now maybe that love for things that's already happened has now evolved into loving things that I didn't really even get to experience. That I now really enjoy now. And I feel like that's, you know, two different categories of liking things from the past, you know? One that's about the things that you remember loving and one that other people remember loving that you want to experience now. And on that note, I'll see you tomorrow.